Hi, my name is Fred Newman. I'm the owner of the View Camera Store and Fred Newman Photography. And today I'd like to talk about drying your film tubes. Let's say you're out on a field trip and you come back with maybe 50, 100 negatives and you've done your first set of processing with your 4x5 BTZS tubes. What do you do to dry your tubes to get them so that you can do your next set? Phil Davis came up with a very ingenious device, a little piece of wood. I've got the details on my Facebook page for View Camera Store, and also I can email you a little copy of uh, an article on how to make this, tu this tube dryer. What you need to do is cut some strips of old rags or towels about two inches wide, and then it's easy to dry the outside of the tubes with your towel, and it's easy to dry the cap because you could just shove the corner in and dry the inside of the cap so that it's perfectly dry, but to get all the way in here it's kind of difficult. So as I say, Phil Davis came up with this, and it's very complicated. You just put a little rag on top like this, put it in the tube, twirl it around until everything is dry, and then you could double check to make sure it's dry. And you will we'll want to cut a whole bunch of rags, like maybe one towel worth of these, so as it gets wet, you could just change the, uh, this little rag here. Um, we used to use them at the workshop, and they worked out fine. So as I say, you want to be sure to keep, keep all the water out of the tube, because if there's a little drip of water, it could get on the emulsion of your negative and cause streaking. So it's not hard to make. Um, just give me uh, an email if you have a problem. And thank you for watching.